Hi guys and welcome. My name is Damian Osborne and I'm an artist and tonight I'm going to be working on this painting here behind me. You can see that I've already done a charcoal drawing of this figure. Uh, now in the Flemish style I'm going to be going over it with the burnt umber as an underpainting. And here we have some burnt umber and this is a medium of um, half linseed oil and half uh, genuine herbs. And this is my trusty Filbert hogshair brush. So here we go. Okay, so a quick summary. Um, I'd like to keep this video fairly short. Um, as you can see behind me, I've completed the burnt umber imprimatura. And imprimatura means the first painting layer in Italian. Um, having a charcoal drawing underneath helps me to get the values and the design down. And uh, I did this drawing fairly detailed to begin with. And then I sprayed it with a fixative before laying down the burnt umber imprimatura. Um, of course, back in the day, artists didn't have a spray fixative like this. Uh, traditionally, they would go over the drawing with a nut or a sepia ink. In some areas, I didn't spray properly, so the charcoal started to lift off, but that's no big deal. You just need to go a little bit more carefully, and I like the dark carbon mix that you get when you mix the burnt umber with the charcoal. 
Sometimes I forgo the charcoal stage and just draw directly on the canvas with my lean oil paint if I'm feeling confident. If you're unsure what the fat of a lean rule means, basically fat means more oily, uh, more oil than solvent. Lean means obviously less oil and more solvent in the mixture. It's important to build up the painting with more fat or oily layers on top of lean layers. This is because the oilier layers are more flexible. So if you have a lean and brittle paint film on top of a more flexible oil film, you'll get more cracking and other problems. For the underpainting, some recipes for mediums call for up to five parts of gum turpentine to one part of linseed oil. That's a very lean medium. But I think as long as you keep your paint film thin and allow plenty of time to dry between the layers and that you don't go backwards and start increasing the ratio of solvent to oil on top of it an already oily layer, you'll be okay. If your medium is too lean, you'll have not enough binder in the pigment and then you could have delamination. I make my canvases myself and prime them with an oil-based primer so that they are fairly absorbent. Even so, I'm going to give the stage a week or two to dry so that the linseed oil can cure. And then I'll start on the next step, which is called the Vidaccio, where I'll make it look like a zombie. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my YouTube channel.